I'm Captain Boomies with Boat Test. Let's check out this beautiful lady. This one is very special though because they have hyper customized it to the owners. She's got these great side decks on both sides that lead up to this bow. And it's not as wide of a bow as I would have thought, but that's because the pilot house takes up a good amount of the forward section of the vessel. That seems like a really smart idea to me, especially if you're gonna be doing big passages with big families like this couple is gonna do. Come on, let me show you the rest. It's for a big family that does big passages and they do it in the Pacific Northwest. So I'm sitting at this giant table and I can feel overhead these great space heaters. <laughs> I am very toasty right now. Let's head on inside. The first super customized piece of this vessel that I fell in love with is a feeding bowl for the dog. They have a dog named Timber and this yacht is for that pup. There's a celebration going on board because the owners just took delivery. So there's gonna be some partying happening and we'll just work our way around that. Join the fun. All of the furniture in the salon is freestanding and has been customized to create tons of walkthrough space. The galley has some fun surprises as well, including extra storage in a space that's normally not very usable. One of the things I talked about before was customizations for the pup who's gonna be on board, and Timber has his own crate. Very elegant. As we move forward, the helm station makes me so happy because it feels like a couple runs this boat. It's a gorgeous his and hers setup, and that's how a team should run a vessel. Let's head below. This is the forward stateroom. It's a double bed with an ensuite and shower that's really good size. Tons of closet space and storage and, oh my God, you can smell the cedar. That's beautiful. As I head back up, you'll notice this is all of my panel switches here. I love when they do this because it means you can just walk down a few steps and not have to bend over and crane your neck in order to switch something on and off. Let's head down to the main suites. Are you ready for the big reveal? The master cabin. With not one, but two ensuite heads. Full bathroom, full shower. Oh my gosh. And the floors are heated. This feels amazing. <laughs> like I said, it's a big family and they have done more staterooms. Let's check these out. Over on the starboard side, oh, with this beautiful slat work. I love this cozy cabin. And on the port side, a double bunk. You can fit so much family in this space. No wonder they go adventuring together. And this is a huge console. In here is the bathroom for the other two staterooms. And it's got a full shower. As we head up these stairs, I want you to notice how stunning this stainless steel work is. It makes this space airy, but also very cool. Welcome to the Flybridge. This space makes so much sense for the family. It's so much room to throw a party and have spectacular views. If you're gonna feed this many people, you're gonna need a big grill. Over here, we have the wet bar so that nobody has to go back down below to the galley to get a new drink. Oh, and they have my favorite, <laughs> the clickies. <laughs> These are so good to make sure that all of your cabinets stay closed in heavy seas. Of course, they have a davit that can handle big water toys or a big tender. The Flybridge Helm Station is the most dramatic place to be when you're out there cruising through this beautiful landscape. 
Oh, it looks like we've got some weather coming. I trust this boat though. Thank you so much for joining me on this tour. I'm gonna go join the family in celebrating the delivery of this boat. But if you enjoyed this, you should check out more of these reviews on BoatTest.com. And remember, life is better on a boat.